The Dust Bowl brought people to Bakersfield, and this is where time stands still. I'm John Bartell, and today we're checking out the Kern County Museum. It was the largest migration to California since the gold rush, the Dust Bowl. During the 1930s, farmers, ranchers, and field workers were forced to load up their old jalopies and leave the drought-stricken plains of the heartland. The destitute farmers were known as Okies, and many of them ended up here in Bakersfield. They came here to try to build a life and, and resettle themselves. Life was pretty tough for the Okies. It was the Depression, and many of them were forced to live in shanty towns, homes made of garbage and discarded wood. These are so small, though. Yeah, I mean, they'd all just, probably a few of them would live in one of these sheds here. Here at the Kern County Museum, they proudly preserve and display a number of shanty houses, but there is one shanty house that is dearest to Bakersfield. And this is the Haggard House, also known as Haggard's Boxcar. Like the hippies out in San Francisco do. Merle Haggard, country music legend and Bakersfield bad boy. And he grew up here in this abandoned boxcar. They come from all over to see us. And we've even had fans and flowers. Haggard was an ex-con who turned his life around playing with Buck Owens, another Bakersfield legend. The two developed the unique Bakersfield Oaky sound, which springboarded their careers. For 30 years, Bakersfield celebrated the Oki culture at the Dust Bowl Festival. The celebration ended in 2019, but you can still see artifacts of Oki's past at the Kern County Museum. Carriages, wagons, tractors, uh, oil trucks. From the home of country music legend Merle Haggard in Bakersfield, I'm John Bartell. Hope to see you on the back road.